Paula Roy here with some Taste of Wellington West virtual programming. On behalf of the Wellington West BIA, I just want to say that I hope you're enjoying this year's spread out version of our Taste Food Festival. We've tried to come up with some new ideas that we hope you're finding interesting, informative, and maybe even a little inspiring. And this time we're doing another takeout unboxing for Takeout Tuesday. So I'll get to this big box in just a minute, but first I wanted to just salute all the restaurant owners and chefs in Wellington Village and Hintonburg who have been doing an amazing job of keeping us well fed the last little while. I love walking down the street and looking at all the options we have. It's really quite astounding how many choices we have. And those that have been doing takeout a long time are doing even better. And those that are new to the takeout game have really got it figured out. So we're very, very lucky. And special mention should be paid to business owners like Erin Clatney of Dish Catering, who chose to expand her business during the pandemic. That's gutsy. She just recently opened her beautiful little parlor space at the corner of Grange and Wellington West. And the intention is to have the indoor portion for events and food related markets and so on. For now, she's doing takeout and also has a really cute little patio on the Grange side of the building. And sometimes you'll find a DJ in action and it's just a vibrant little space. So for parlors takeout offerings, you can order online or you can phone in your order. And you can also walk up and read the menu that's painted on the window and place your order right there and wait to pick it up. So they have a few different options and today I've got their half feast box to show you. So let's open it up and see what's inside. I'll turn it around so you can get a good look as I pull everything out. And oh my goodness, does it ever smell good when I took the lid off. I can just smell all the delicious aromas. I cannot wait. So the first thing that caught my eye, the fries. I love a good fry. And kudos to Parlor for not putting a lid on this container so that they don't get soggy. And I really appreciate that. And while your fries may get cool in transit, depending on how far you have to travel with your boxed meal, don't worry if you just spread them out on a parchment lined baking sheet and put them in an oven at about 325 for five to eight minutes, they're gonna be piping hot and crispy just as though they came out of the fryer. So those are some good looking fries. Next up, we've got a box. I wonder what's in here. Oh, it's beautiful greens. These are from Terramore Farm in the Ottawa Valley and I can just tell how fresh they are. They look so good. There's microgreens in there, some tomatoes, some sliced radishes, and a little container of dressing on the side. I really appreciate that thoughtful touch as well because it means that the greens are not gonna get soggy in transit and you can also apply however much dressing you prefer. So that is a beautiful looking salad. And we've got two containers here. Let's open one up. Oh, it's beautiful corn chowder. Oh, it smells heavenly. I think it's grilled corn, and I can just tell by the heft of this container that it's really gonna be thick and rich and delicious. Just smells so old-fashioned and homemade and wonderful. So that's a really, really nice touch and a great change for, for fall to have a warm soup. And again, you could easily reheat these soup containers if need be. So we've got two containers of soup, and those are generous portions. Now for the biggest dish in here, let's open it up. Oh wow, this is grilled marinated flank steak. And I can see that it is a perfect medium rare, which I love. And it's been sliced and fanned out, so it's really easy to serve and to eat. And there's also some grilled vegetables. And in this container, we've got some chimichurri, which is an herb-based sauce that goes super well with flank steak. So that's gonna be a really nice drizzle to put on top of the steak. And this presentation is brilliant because you could pick the steak and vegetables up just by the edges of this paper and transfer it to your own platter and then scooch the paper out if you wanted to have a bit more fancy presentation for your takeout meal. So that's very, very thoughtful as well. Now this is what they refer to as their half feast and it's intended to serve one to two people, it says on the website. I'm not even sure the two of us are gonna be able to eat all this food. They're very, very generous portions. And as I mentioned, this is the grilled flank steak version. There's also a chicken version available and it's half a grilled spatchcocked chicken. And if you don't know what spatchcock is, it's basically a chicken where the backbone has been cut out and the chicken gets flattened. They're often called flattened chickens and grilled. And the advantage is that in that shape, the chicken grills much more quickly and so it doesn't have time to dry out. So you'll find the meat much more flavorful and tender and juicy. So this is the half feast, full feast is also available. So obviously double the portions so that would easily feed a larger family. Now, what's a meal without a sweet finish? And 
Dish Catering has made a name for its desserts, so I'm sure this parlor option of a beautiful lemon and berry trifle is gonna be fantastic. I love the presentation and the cute little mason jars, and it just means the layers are gonna stay the way that they were intended, so it looks beautiful, and then super easy just to pop the lid off and enjoy it when you're ready. So this is a pretty awesome feast. I think it's been very appropriately named, and I can't wait to taste it because I know it's gonna be delicious. So if this inspires you to order up your own feast from Parlor, I invite you to please take a minute to post a picture of it on social media using the hashtag Taste of Wellington West, and you'll automatically be entered into our draw to win a gift card from the local merchant of your choice. Happy Takeout Tuesday, everyone.